This was written uh, for Earth Day 1990 in Berkeley. Uh, but I want to dedicate it to the youth who have been striking in terms of climate justice and the Extinction Rebellion. We just had a demonstration at UN Plaza last week. The youth are leading. And they will accomplish what my generation, our generation, did not accomplish. Because the stakes are so dire. This is an invocation to Gaia. Imagine all the things that have fed you, held you, warmed you, clothed and supported you, source of all that you are. Beyond the woman who gave you birth, back to the source of all birth, all life, all death too. Home of everything you are and know. Imagine all the beautiful things you have seen, the sounds you have heard, the smells, touches, tastes, the pulsations of the oceans and rivers, the mountains and glaciers, each with its rhythms of coming to be and passing away. Picture her as we have seen in photographs from space, this source of all, pearl of our solar system and alive in the flux that is the cosmos. Her changes that we breathe into our very soul, the patterns of her dark and light, of cold and heat, privation and abundance, the seasons of the years and of our lives. See her emotions, the flux that washes over our shores as the waters strain to rise to their sister moon, the ragged peaks that mount out of the seas with their skirts girt with green, the towering trees and cathedral calm of the redwood groves, wildflowers, growing meadows, a trickle with melting snow that is source of all that grows, all that thirsts. Taste the waters of Mother Gaia, set at her teats, and feel your connection. Drink until you can drink no more. This Gaia is vital for every part of poor dancing in the delight of the cosmos. Think back to Gaia and her youth when all the, her rivers were wild and free, when clouds took their colors from sky and sea, and not from plumes of smoke and urban rot. No, this Gaia is filled with all varieties of communities in glade and hill, woods and stream, and only her rivers are cutting deep gashes into her skin, carving into her rocks convoluted calligraphic tales of all she has seen. And down deep under all, Gaia, turning her insides out into fiery exudations of herself, new rock and ocean floor pushing up and out to continuously generate her new skin. On this our planet, the goddess perpetually giving birth to herself. We call you here with us today into our circle. We call on you to speak to us, to dance with us, singing our songs that you have taught us. Be here now. Thank you.